What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Big Mike, man. Back at you again with another Banger Dundini. Um, real quick uh, update, man. Sorry for the hiatus, man. I've been busy. You guys see I'm not really consistent on this channel. I started another channel um, dealing with these uh, these old bangers over here, man. So, um, yeah, you know, um, I, I went to a gun show today, man, and kind of met up with um, um, the guy Bob over there, a uh, partner of mine um, at Bayside Coin and Jury. Um, he has a booth, uh, always kind of gets a booth at the gun show. Um, so he invited me out to the gun show. But yeah, I was going to the gun show today to make some some uh, material for my other channel. Um, as you guys know, I just had my rights restored. So I'm now into a new hobby, the new side of my Prepperville, right? <laughs> I'm, I'm um, stacking guns, man, you know, uh, in silver. I may I may stop for a while. I got an AR-15 on the way. Um, and... Uh, yeah, you know, so I'll be playing with that. But real quick, I just wanted to make sure that everybody knows that, um, you know, the gun is safe. Um, it is empty. You know, they say we have to make sure that we're doing that. This is the Taurus um, G3C. Um, and it is a nine millimeter. Um, beautiful gun, kind of snappy. Um, yeah, just a beautiful gun, man. I love it. Um, the, the aim is nice. Got Glock sights, got a safety trigger, um, on it here. Um, just beautiful, man. Um, yeah. So anyway, that was, that was my first gun. Um, I really appreciate it. And then here we have the, um, the Caltech KS7 bullpup single barrel shotgun holds seven plus one. Um, six, if they're three inches, six plus one, if they're two and three quarter inches and 13, if they're the little small minis, um, got tremendous kick to it. Um, I just put a, um, one second. I just put a sight on it, a green dot and red dot sight. We just kind of installed the rail and put that on it. Um, but yeah, outside of that, um, I bought me some silver today. I know y'all are here for the silver. I bought me some silver today. Um, I bought a two ounce, let me see here, I bought a two ounce, um, this is the same people who make the privateer, this has the Statue of Liberty on it, I don't know if you can see that that well, um, there we go, has the Statue of Liberty on it, um, the American flag in the background, um, this is a beautiful fat little two ounce round um, picture of America. North America on the back. Um, it is kind of bubbled shaped. These are the same people that the elemental that made privateer, um, rounds. You guys remember those with the, the pirates on them and the Kraken and all that. I used to have that. I got it tucked away somewhere or either I sold it. I can't remember. Um, but yeah, I bought that. I also got some beautiful Johnson Matthews 1986. Silver rounds, freedom. It says freedom, the American way, right? You got the thirteen colonized little uh, flag there. Some guns, right? Nineteen eighty six Johnson and Mathis. Matthew, excuse me. Beautiful nine 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 fine silver. Um, I ended up picking up two of those. Beautiful condition. Um, these were pretty expensive. Well, these are going to my collection. You guys know I got a collection I plan to leave to my boy. Unless we sell it for some land or or towards something or something like that. So, yeah. And then I got a different type. Those two are the same. And then I got another one here. Um, Freedom of the Press. Right? Beautiful. Johnson Matthews again. Yeah, this is a beautiful... Beautiful round, triple nines, fine. One troy ounce of fine silver. And then just because, <clears throat> just because I'm in the guns, just because, you know, I kind of got that American theme. I got the red, white, and the blue um, and some armory. I had to go ahead and get the MK bars, uh, fallen soldier. I had to get that piece of silver. It's about two ounces of silver. Um, MK bars, um, got the little M16, little helmet, the flag, 
Um, I just thought that would be a beautiful, beautiful piece to put there. Um, also, I got the 80% Canadian um, silver dollars. This one is a 1952. Good condition. I decided to get it. Mama, there go that chick again. Um, yeah, decided to get that. And then this one is a 1939. 1939. Canadian silver dollar. Same thing. As the other one, we got a 53. And we got those beautiful death totems. I picked up a couple more of these. I love these. Another little boat one. I forgot the name of them. Uh, Canoe Willie. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. I just made that up. Then I picked up a um, 1921 Morgan Silver Dollar um, to add to the collection. This is all going to my, uh, my 90% and my 80%. Um, silver stack, but yeah, it is what it is. I got some 12 gauge, um, rounds, buck shots, um, not to double lot. These is bird shots. I'm, I'm practicing with my son. Um, I got them, you know, these is number eights. Um, we just got some targets. Uh, we bought about 75 rounds of those. We just kind of going through those. I'm getting him used to, used to the shotgun. Um, we bought some tools for the, uh, AR-15. Um, we got a, we just bought a, um, a, a blue dot and a flashlight for, uh, for the Picatinny rail down here, um, on the bottom of the gun. This goes down there, uh, on the gun, but beautiful, beautiful piece here. Um, so yeah, we got that. We picked this up on Amazon for like 38 bucks. Um, oh, I believe this was on eBay. Yeah, we picked this up on on eBay for like 38 bucks. Um, cool little deal. Um, we like it. It has both the red dot, excuse me, the blue dot and the light. Um, I thought that was a cool little buy. <clears throat> and these are just some FMJ, some full metal jacket, nine millimeters, um, aluminum casing. Um, we will be getting some self-defense rounds. Once again, we just bought these for target practice for my son. Um, to actually, you know, kind of play with those a little bit, but yeah, man, you know, we've just been on a mission, check out our other channel. Um, when you get a chance, look back on the other channel or we may put it in the, um, in, in the, the box down below. Um, if not, we'll just continue to kind of maybe upload both, um, videos to this channel and the other channel. I'm going to take this one and upload it to the other channel. Shout out, man, to, um, everybody that's been rocking with your boy, man, follow me. Uh, make sure that you continue to hit that subscribe button, that like button. Sometimes, you know, you guys get unsubscribed. You guys send me messages saying, hey, man, you know, I'm not getting notifications of your videos no more. I found that I was unsubscribed. Make sure that you check in that subscribe button if you want to be tuned in um, to the channel. Uh, make sure that you hit that that thumbs up button. That'll kind of help with the algorithm that really help us continue to get the channel out there. Um, I look forward to any new subscribers. Share the channel on your page. Um, if you really care about your boy and you want to see your boy, um, get this channel growing so I can bring you more content. Um, the content is getting better. The more, the more I do this, the better I'm getting. Um, I think my last giveaway was, was it 10 ounces? Um, five ounces? I think it might have been a five ounce bar. Before that, I think it was three ounces or something like that. Um, yeah, I'll be doing the giveaway here soon. Not sure what I'll be doing the giveaway. Uh, what I'll be giving to give away. Maybe I'll do an interview at uh, Bayside Coin. Uh, again, talk to those guys. Uh, maybe they want to do a giveaway. Maybe they want to donate something for me to give away um, to you guys. Something cool. Maybe something rare. Uh, maybe something so somebody don't have. Um, leave a comment down below and let me know some, um, maybe some coins um, or some you guys hope to have one day that you don't have. Um, what's something rare or what's something that, uh, you guys would like to be seen, uh, or like to see to be given away. Um, and with that, man, I just want to say, man, thanks for rocking with your boy back. I'm back again with some oohs and ahs, man. It's a movie, man. You know what I mean? So make sure that you stay tuned, um, and continue to watch the channel with that. I'm going to say peace.